In December 2011, Waste Management and the Atlantis Casino Resort Spa partnered up to launch Northern Nevada's first casino organics recycling program. This is a process where food scraps and other organic material are separated and diverted from the traditional waste stream and turned into compost. In 2011, the Atlantis also implemented what they call single stream recycling. This allows recyclable materials such as cardboard, paperboard, paper, plastics, aluminum, steel cans, and all that stuff to be deposited into one container for recycling. Wow, the Atlantis is doing some serious recycling. We have implemented a couple of different uh, programs. We have an organics recycling program, we have a single stream uh, recycling program, and then we also have our, our energy conservation program. Um, and all of those uh, programs combined are our, our effort for um, being green and helping to make sure that we are good custodians and good stewards of, of the planet. Over the course of just this last year, we've had 3,300 yards of recyclable material that um, equates into about uh, 111 30-yard compostable materials that are not going into our landfill. Wow, that's a lot. It, it is a lot. So if you've ever had any projects at home and you mm -hmm. call waste management and get the big dumpster, think of one of those and 111 of those not going into our landfill extends the life of our landfills. And that's for one year? That's just one year and that's just one property. It must have been a huge undertaking for an organization the size of the Atlantis to implement a composting program. Our, our food and beverage director took the bull by the horns and said, we need to do this. This is a, a good thing for our community. This is a good thing for the company. Um, we wanted to step out and be the first, and we were proud to introduce that organics recycling. And so we looked into it um, and just made it happen. We always are looking for ways to help our customers become environmentally friendly and look for environmental solutions. And the Atlantis was talking about different ways that they could enhance their contribution to the environment and whatnot. And so our sales representative worked with them, did the waste audit, and then we provided training to their entire staff, to their management staff, and we continue to check in with them on a quarterly basis to see if there's any tweaks or anything we need to make to continue to enhance the program. Uh, we noticed that uh, we were getting a lot of plastic, a lot of material that it can be turned around for a lot of purpose. And that's combined with the food waste that we get out of all the eight kitchens that we have in this property. Um, we decided to put this program together and um, that's how everything began. The program began in the buffet. Reason being is because it's our largest um, restaurant so for that, we decide to uh, begin our program in the buffet. If he, if he was going to work, he was going to work in the buffet. And then that means he was going to work for the rest of the outlets. Basically, you can recycle pretty much anything besides glass and styrofoam. So it'll be plastic, aluminum, canned goods, uh, paper goods, cardboard, newspaper, magazines, you name it. We can go all around. And when they're uh, um, preparing all the vegetables, fruits, uh, salads, uh, any leftovers, bones, um, leftover food that we don't use in the end of the night or in the end of the shift, it goes into that recycle container. The Atlantis has been so successful. They have an incredible staff that's dedicated and they've really made this a part of their culture. We have come to them and provided a lot of training. So their staff is very knowledgeable about what waste goes into which bin. And that has just led to great success that we've seen. They exceeded their goal by 56% in 2012 and we're looking to exceed it again in 2013. It was quite a challenge for them, but you know what? We made it happen and uh, we came through and uh, we've seen good results now. The food composting program, also referred to as the Organics Recycling Program, started in the buffet and then expanded to all eight restaurants in the casino. The partnership with Waste Management has been so successful, they eventually added the employee cafeteria and housekeeping to the program. During my conversation with the Atlantis, I learned that some large organizations won't even consider a hotel for their convention if they don't have a green program. And of course, these conventions are very important to our local economy. It's very important for us to help get those groups into town. It's the hotel, it's the 
taxis, it's the airlines, it's the restaurants. There's a, there's a huge trickle down economic impact from conventions and we need to get more of them in Reno. So I'll just speak for everyone in our community. Um, I'd like to thank you guys for doing your part in keeping um, the community green and in, in doing things that are, are leading you know, people in the right direction as well as getting tourists here to town to help help our economic recovery. So that's really awesome. Absolutely. We're, we're proud. We're proud and pleased to do it. We, we want to be a community leader. We want to give back to our community um, and we want to keep everything green and going in the future.